Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com. I just wanted to give you a quick tour around our brand new Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the NinjaTrader NT8 platform. This is not just an indicator suite. It's a, it's a swing trading strategy that works on multiple time frames on uh, futures, stocks and Forex. And something I've been using as a money manager for the last 12 years. I've developed this for the platforms and now it's live for NinjaTrader NT8 platforms. Let's go through it. So first of all, the main thing is we get the Elliott Wave count. So we see down here on the left where the cursor is, we've got the one, the two, the three, the four and the fifth wave. This Elliott Wave count can be isolated anywhere by just clicking underneath the candle, pressing F5 and it realigns. Obviously, we've got to be looking for uh, lows and highs to get the, re the, the proper indicator count. So we've got a low here down on the left, but a long wave three. And then the wave four pulls back into our pullback zones. These are three zones, uh, the green, the amber and the red. So the green zone, if the wave four finds support in this zone, then it's got an 85% probability is going on and making a new wave five high. 80% in the amber zone and 75% in the red zone. We also have special moving averages here. In the blue, it's a 6 4 moving average high, and this is used for entries, uh, conservative entries into long positions. Also, a trailing stop position for shorts. And then conversely, we have the 6 4 moving average low, which is used for conservative entries on short positions or trailing stops on long positions. Down the bottom here, we have a 535 oscillator, and we look and measure this pullback during the, during the wave four as part of the strategy to see how well the wave four has performed. We build that together with the pullback zone, and we look for a high probability trade to trade that fifth wave. So this is just a, uh, an example on NQ on futures. Let's go to a current trade that I've got running short on CAH. So again, as you can see, the wave count started right at the high here on the left. We've had wave one, the wave two, and then a very long wave three, which has included a couple of gaps there, but that's still a wave three. The wave four pulled back into the green zone, which is 85% probability it's gonna go on and continue on the main downward trend for this stock. So I entered uh, down here uh, just below the 6.4 moving average low. So let's just go a little bit bigger here. Uh, so I entered just here, stop loss just above the wave four. And again, all this strategy is explained in the boot count that comes along with this indicator suite, all the entry strategies and everything like that. And then the target zone is down here for this. So we're doing well, we're in decent profit making position at the moment. And this looking like hitting the target over the next uh, few days, uh, if not the next week. One of the things we also look at is the wave four pullback on the oscillator. That's between a specified 90 to 140 percent. Again, we cover how to do this all in the four hour boot camp with this Elliott Wave indicator suite. Let's have another look at another example here on CL on oil. This is a five minute chart. So as you can see, we've had the lows down here. We've had a long wave three, but a substantial wave four pullback into the green zone. 85% probability and then we went on and made a new wave five high on the five minute chart. Again, entry strategy is important on this type of trade. Uh, just about outside the 6.4 moving average high and as you can see made a really decent move up to the wave five high there. So that's on a five minute chart. Now we'll go to Forex and we'll look at Euro US dollar on the daily. So as we can see here, we've got some corrective moves and then we start on a really good bullish trend. We pull back on a wave two. All of these uh, are automatically uh, put on the chart for you by the indicator suite. We've had the wave three, the wave four's dipped its toe into the green and then we've had the long for the wave five. 
Again, we can isolate these wave counts uh, anywhere. We can start off at the top here, uh, press F5, and it realigns the wave count there. We can go to any area where we think the trend has started. So we click down here, press F5, and as you can see, if we take this as the low, as the start, we're on a wave 4 pullback right now. The oscillator down at the bottom is in the red. It's pulled back. Looking good. We're looking for that to crown soon. And so far in Euro US dollar on the daily, this wave 4 is looking good. The pullback zones are dynamic. So as soon as the wave 3 actually does find a high, they then stop moving and they just move to the right as we get the price action each day or each five minute time frame or, or anything like that. So this is a great indicator suite for Forex, futures and stocks traders, whether you're swing trading off a daily time frame or you're doing a quick swing trade uh, intraday or you know, you're just looking for those pullback zones and this indicator suite does it very well for you as well as count the Elliott waves for you. So that's it. Click on the button now and take advantage of this great Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for Ninja Trader 8.